Hi, my name is Laura, and today I'd like to introduce you to Tanium Investigate. Tanium Investigate solves the problem every company in the world faces. When something goes wrong, how do we find out what went wrong so we can fix it? And how do we make sure the issue doesn't happen again? Investigate is another Tanium capability that comes directly from conversations with our customers. So many of our customers describe the painstaking hoops their teams had to jump through to find the root cause of help desk tickets, server outages, security incidents, and other business impacting issues. Often they jump between more than five different tools to get the right level of visibility. So much time wasted by limitations in their tech stack. Tanium Investigate empowers teams to dramatically reduce the time they spend on root cause analysis and incident resolution time through three core capabilities, deep and converged visibility, remote management and collaboration, and key integrations with partners like ServiceNow. Let's get into the demo. Picture this scenario. An end user creates a ServiceNow ticket because their laptop is working slowly. The ticket arrives at the help desk and, after a quick triage, I need more information to figure out what's behind the performance degradation. With Tanium's out-of-the-box integration with ServiceNow, the click of a button will redirect me into Tanium to delve deeper into Jane Doe's concerns on our laptop. This key integration between ServiceNow and Tanium makes the transition from ticketing system to investigation seamless. Once I've been redirected into Tanium and direct connect to Jane's laptop, I am dropped into the endpoint. I'll have a wealth of historical data available to dig into what was happening on the endpoint that could be responsible for the performance concerns Jane is describing. I first see a performance timeline depicting stats like CPU and memory usage, which I can toggle back in time and zoom out to different timeframes as needed. As I view the performance timeline, we notice the yellow bars indicating different events, most likely related to performance impacts. Events such as installation of browser plugins, user authentication events, external storage connected, CPU spikes, application crashes, and more. In this case, it looks like CPU is going haywire. I also notice an application and system crash. Let's scroll down to the grid view for more detailed information. As expected, I see the line item around high CPU and the crashes I mentioned. If I want more information, I can open these side panels where I'm able to see the top processes running in the time that CPU is spiking. I also see the calendar icon that will scope me to the exact time frame an event was ongoing. In this case, it's still happening, so I don't need to jump back in time here. Let's talk processes though. I see that antivirus was among the top two processes consuming the most CPU, which might indicate to me that we should check on AV exclusions. I don't have the right permissions to do that, and I'll have to ask a colleague to get involved. Now let's see what events were going on around this time. Businessapp.exe crashed, and I also have a system crash. The app crash might require an update, which I would want to push out through Tanium Deploy, if that's the case but I need more information before I can proceed here. To start, let's say I want my coworker, Josh, to check on AB exclusions for me before I intervene with Jane's system. One of the most frustrating aspects of digging into detailed endpoint data is trying to share the specifics with my team. I don't want to spend 10 minutes copy pasting what I've seen just to get my team up to speed. What if there was a way for me to take notes as I go and have my team be able to access the same details I felt were relevant? This is where I can save the details of my digging into an investigation, along with my comments for a clean handoff to the rest of my team. This gives quick access to all the investigative details already gathered and root cause information. I can add the activities on screen to an investigation, any artifacts I think are interesting and want to dig into more to an investigative workflow. I can choose to add the CPU spike and app and system crashes to either an existing workflow or create a net new one. I'll go ahead and do that now. First, I'll raise this to medium priority since Jane can still go about her day-to-day -day work in the background. I'll give it a quick name and I'll put this in Josh's workflow. Now, once I hit the add button, this action will save the case in Titanium Investigate the case management workflow, where I'll be able to follow my investigation from end to end in one place with my colleagues to collaborate together. 
I'm dropped immediately inside my investigate case, where any one of my colleagues can pick up where I left off. Investigate is the central workspace where you can quickly transition from a security, operations, or help desk related investigation to remediation at scale. Within my case, colleagues can see every activity I added from the investigate tab for their attention. All the earlier performance events I selected from the investigate tab, like the ongoing CPU spike, and the discrete events like the application and the system crashes. And if there had been any recordings from inside Tanium threat response, those would render here as well. They can also see the moment that the ServiceNow ticket was created by Jane Doe. I can also add comments, both at the event level or at the meta level for this investigation. Things like, please check on AV exclusions with Microsoft Defender here. Are they written correctly? This makes it easy for my colleagues to gather all the context they need to close out this investigation. At this point, Josh will pick up where I left off now that the case has been assigned to him. After my handover, I decide to work on another case in my own queue. Taking a step back from Jane's example, I can see my organization's key stats at a glance inside the Investigate homepage. Things like average mean time to resolution on all cases closed, initial activity prompting an investigation, like a ServiceNow ticket, how many ongoing investigations are currently open, their priority and status, and the current docket for who's owning what. I can click on my name and start working on another investigation in flight. Now let's switch gears a bit. Say our example involved needing to kill a process that's running hot on Jane's laptop. To do that, we'll explore remote management. This tab will allow you to remotely delete files through file browser or stop a process through process control. You'll want to do this anytime you feel comfortable taking action without disturbing the end user's productivity. Click on File Browser at the top. Here, you can view any plain text file without having to download it. You can select any file you want to delete here or choose to download. If instead you want to kill a process without notifying Jane, you could do that below too. Fast forward to remediation. My colleague Josh determined that the proper AV exclusions were not in place, which he was able to fix for Jane. He also used Tanium Deploy to push out an updated business app version that should fix the bug behind the crash. Now we want to make sure our changes had the intended effect we want on the endpoint. We can use Tanium Engage to create a survey where we check on Jane's status. Was her issue resolved? To do so, I'll pivot to the Engage module, which many customers use together with Investigate to survey the end user and ask if they're seeing an improvement in their experience. I just created a survey question asking whether Jane has observed an improvement in her user experience. If she selects no, I've also added a link to a knowledge document on next steps she can take for this particular incident. Overall, Tanium Investigate reduces mean time to resolution by surfacing potential root causes, enabling you to collaborate with colleagues in one workspace, and allowing you to remotely manage endpoints without involving the end user. One of our customers in early availability mode mentioned how his workflow in Tanium Investigate save an hour of time versus his normal routine. Reduce your mean time to resolution, machine downtime, and OPEX costs while improving your org's productivity with Tanium Investigate. If you want to learn more, reach out to our Tanium sales team or a Tanium partner for a live demo. You can request to evaluate Tanium Investigate via POC and consider doing a Tanium risk assessment to uncover other benefits by seeing the Tanium platform in your environment. Thanks for watching.